Like the Tibetan prayer flags, Karma Triana Dharma Chakra proclaims its blessings for Westerners and Tibetans alike. Karma Triana Dharma Chakra Monastery, or KTD as it is called, is located high above the small town of Woodstock, New York. KTD is the largest authentic Tibetan Buddhist monastery in North America. The golden wheel symbolizes the teachings of the Buddha. The two deer symbolize the tranquil and peaceful qualities that these teachings offer for all beings. These special Buddhist symbols of peace, tranquility, and compassion are mounted on top of the Karma Triana Dharma Chakra Monastery. KTD's purpose is to preserve the ancient Tibetan Buddhist meditation tradition and practices and make them available here in the West. Karma Triana Dharma Chakra is an authentic Tibetan Buddhist monastery, modeled after similar monasteries built over the past thousand years in Tibet and places such as Nepal, Bhutan, and northern India. In the peaceful solitude high atop Lookout Mountain, KTD integrates completely with the surrounding mountain landscape. As any visitor can attest, the KTD main shrine room with its 11-foot gold-covered Buddha, vivid silk tapestries, statues, paintings, and sacred texts is breathtaking. A sensory experience of color and beauty that is deeply satisfying. KTD is a living treasury of Tibetan Buddhist culture and tradition, open to all who seek a more peaceful life. At Karma Triana Dharma Chakra, the traditional teachings and practice of the Karma Kagyu lineage of Tibetan Buddhism are being preserved and made available to students here in the West. KTD's mission is to preserve and make available not only the oral tradition of teachings, empowerments, and training, but also to preserve the arts, music, culture, and texts of Tibet. In Karma Kagyu Tibetan Buddhism, the role of the Lama, or teacher, takes on special significance. The Buddhist teachings, traditions, art, and culture have been passed down from Lama to student in an unbroken lineage of oral tradition and direct transmission, teacher to student. By presenting the teachings of the Buddha, Karma Triana Dharma Chakra promotes meditation and the principles of peaceful self-discipline, altruism, and compassion. The construction of the main monastery is a stunning achievement of integrated art, architecture, and cultural integrity. As one tours the monastery, it's clear that every element of art, building, and ornamentation has been handcrafted by Tibetan masters and carefully trained Western students. How then did Karma Triana Dharma Chakra come to North America? The history of KTD begins with the Tibetan Lama, who is head of the Karma Kagyu lineage. He is known as the Karmapa. Rangjung Rikpe Dorje, the 16th Galwa Karmapa, was born in Tibet in 1924. Buddhists hold that great teachers like the Karmapa choose to be reborn in this world again and again because they have taken a vow to help all sentient beings to reach enlightenment. The name Karmapa means he who performs the activity of a Buddha.
When the Karmapa puts on the black crown, he transforms himself into the Bodhisattva of compassion, and all present become a part of his mind and share in that experience. In 1980, the Karmapa, who was seriously ill with cancer, dedicated the site for Karma Triana Dharma Chakra in Woodstock, New York. The following year, the Karmapa died. The Karmapas are the only reincarnate lamas who discover themselves, rather than be discovered by other lamas. They do this by leaving a detailed letter describing the place of their next birth and other information. His Holiness the 16th Karmapa left such a detailed letter which led to a young nomad boy being found in eastern Tibet who had been born June 26, 1985. His birth and whereabouts fit the description in the letter left by the 16th Karmapa. It was clear to all that this was the 17th Karmapa. The young Karmapa was brought to Sirpu Monastery, the ancestral home of the Karmapas, where he received a huge welcome. He was enthroned at Sirpu Monastery on September 27, 1992, before a crowd of over 20,000 pilgrims. His next few years were spent primarily in Dharma studies. On December 28, 1999, the 14-year-old Karmapa and a handful of attendants secretly left Sirpu Monastery in the Tulung Valley and escaped Tibet. On January 5, 2000, he arrived safely in Dharamsala, India, where he was met by His Holiness the 14th Dalai Lama. We can look forward to a visit to the United States by the young Karmapa in the near future. In fact, he has sent us this message. Sasamsame in 1980, during his last tour of the United States, the 16th Karmapa prepared this drawing and dedicated the site for Karma Triana Dharma Chakra. His vision was to establish an authentic Karma Kagyu Buddhist monastery to be built above the town of Woodstock in New York State to share the Buddhist meditation practice with Westerners. Raising capital and building the monastery took over nine years of hard work on the part of the Lamas and is the result of a combined effort between Tibetans and Americans. Although the foundation was laid in April of 1982, it was not until January of 1989 that the 11 foot Buddha was installed and consecrated in what is known as the eye opening ceremony. As vividly breathtaking as Karma Triana Dharma Chakra has become, KTD is still not yet complete. Although the main temple is now finished, there is as yet no suitable place to house the teachers, monks, nuns, and students, as is the case in a traditional Tibetan Buddhist monastery. KTD has been using a turn-of-the-century building for staff residents and administration, 
Renovating the old building is not feasible at any cost. As Karma Trana Dharma Chakra exists today, the 16th Karmapa's vision as a complete monastery remains unfinished. In May of 1998, KTD set planning in motion to complete the 16th Karmapa's vision. The addition to the monastery is expected to cost just over $5 million. With the generous support of Children Foundation and other patrons, the capital campaign fundraising goal is now 60% complete. With over $3 million raised, plans are now underway to finish the complex in accordance with Tibetan tradition. The addition will provide housing for monks, nuns, and students, including ample space for sacred art and even a library of Buddhist texts. Today, there is an increasing interest in the centuries-old Buddhist system of training and steadying the mind. In addition to being the seat of the Karmapas in America, KTD is recognized as a major center for the training of Western and Tibetan teachers or lamas. The 16th Karmapa entrusted the responsibility of building the KTD monastery to three members of his staff, Kempo Katar Rinpoche, Bardotuku Rinpoche, and Tenjin Choni. KTD is also a culture center for many Tibetans living in the United States. Here is a gathering of Sherpas celebrating the Tibetan New Year just outside the monastery building. In Tibetan culture, the teachings of the Buddha and the culture of daily life are completely intertwined. In addition to the monastery, KTD has also completed two other major projects. On a high mountain peak in Colorado, overlooking the plains some thousands of feet below, stands the Karma Tegsum Tashi Gomag Stupa, a 40-foot traditional Buddhist shrine with dome and spire. In 1992, the Karma Ling Retreat Training Center was completed, including separate retreat buildings for men and women plus a Lama residence. These retreat facilities ensure the continuation of monastic training in North America. The serene light of butter lamps represents a tradition integral to Tibetan Buddhist meditation practice and symbolizes hopes for peace, tranquility, and compassion in our lives. The Tibetan Lamas ensure the authenticity of KTD, the preservation of Buddhist teachings, culture, architecture, and art. Real and living metaphor, Karma Trana Dharma Chakra serves as a Tibetan Buddhist light for the Western world, offering continuous benefits and blessings for all. But there is more to be done to complete the vision of Karma Trana Dharma Chakra. Your help is needed now to ensure that this incredible heritage continues here in the West. Karma Trana Dharma Chakra has commissioned the construction of the new residence addition as well as the removal of the old and failing turn-of-the-century building. Groundbreaking is planned for late in spring of 2001. Over this summer, the land will be prepared and the foundation for the addition will be constructed. The new building must be completely framed out and enclosed before the cold sets in. During the winter of 2002, the interior facades, heating, plumbing, and electric will be installed. Removal of the central old white building, landscaping, and parking facilities will be completed during the summer for readiness by fall of 2002. For more than 20 years, hundreds of people have contributed their labor, time, and financial resources to assure the completion of each of the various parts of Karma Triana Dharma Chakra. The monastery has been constructed at the main site. A retreat center has been built in Delhi, New York, and a reliquary shrine has been erected at Crestone, Colorado. Thousands of people have visited these sites and been touched and transformed by the blessings radiating from KTD. The final and remaining part must now be completed. The ancient Buddhist culture of Tibet has been almost completely extinguished within Tibet by the communist system. But this priceless heritage has not been completely lost. By your extraordinary generosity, you can create a personal and permanent memorial dedication 
at Karma Tree on a Dharma Chakra. Our large gift memorial planning guide affords a variety of gift levels that will honor your very personal and lasting participation. All the sacred Tibetan Buddhist teachings, text, culture, and artistic heritage have been painstakingly replicated and thrive at Karma Triana Dharma Chakra. At KTD, the ancient Buddhist mantras, art, and sacred meditation methods resonate for lasting peace in our world. We have come a long way. Join with us in completing the vision for KTD. Share in the tranquil joy of Karma Triana Dharma Chakra. Make your commitment now. Uh...